Are you living? Are you existing? Are you alive? Are you breathing in every moment of life? Not everybody can do that. It's hard to do that. It's hard to recognize the things that we have around us and be thankful and grateful for the things that we have in our life, except wanting and wishing and desiring for more things that we don't have, things that our friends have, things that our coworkers have, things that our Facebook and Instagram fans have and they tweet about that they really don't have, they don't have that joy in their life. Are you alive? That's what I really wanna know. If I ask you one question right now, are you really living? Are you living to your full potential? Are you really breathing, consuming the air around you or is it automatic? Because automatically our brain kicks in. It does it ourselves. We could go to bed at night and you could sleep for six hours, two hours, eight hours and never even have to think about breathing. You sitting at your office desk right now at your cubicle, behind your computer, on Facebook, wherever you're watching this and you're just breathing because it's automatic, it's natural for us. Did you really take in that deep breath of oxygen? Are you really consuming air or are you just a mouth breather? And I'm asking you this for a reason. I'm asking you to recognize, just, just step back real quick away from your surroundings, away from the stress, the problems that you have in your life. I'm asking you to just take a look, take stock at what you really have, of where you are right now. I just finished up an incredible workout. I'm sweating, I'm excited, I'm exhausted, but man, I was so pumped up and I'm outside breathing and it's so beautiful right now today. How many times are you going to stop? How many times do you stop and really take in that breath of fresh air and be thankful for the things that we have in our life and that we take for granted every day. Are you really breathing? Are you really living? Are you existing? Now, I'm asking you this because I'm gonna challenge you guys. I, I just wanna challenge you. If you're watching this video, I, I really wanna challenge you to, to make the most out of your life. And it starts with one thing, making a decision. And you've got to make a decision of who you want to become. Not, not what you want to do, not how much money you want to make, or not what job title you want to have, not how many friends on Instagram you have, how many followers you have, how many likes you got. I'm not talking about that. I'm like, who do you really want to be? Who do you want to become? If you could be anything you can, you can dream of and you knew you wouldn't fail, what would it be? What would you do if you had a bigger purpose? How would you live your life if you could live bigger than yourself? If you weren't selfish about the things in your life? We all get that way. I get that way myself. And I have to sit back, relax, take a deep breath. Where am I going? What am I doing? What am, what am I doing this for? Why did I buy this? Why am I renting this? Why are we leasing this? Why do we have to go and do this? Why do we spend our money on this? Why did I spend my time on this? I just wasted three days of my life. I just wasted the last two years. What are you saying? What are you really doing? What do you want to accomplish? Are you living? Are you existing day to day? Are you already looking forward towards Friday? Are you already excited about Christmas break? Are you examining your life on a daily basis to figure out where you want to be? And, and I know 90% of the people are going to say no. It, it, you have to be really purposeful when you do this. Uh, so I, I didn't want to leave a long video, a long message. I just want you to take, take stock. So if you can... If you can just think about where you want to be six months from now, where you want to be a year from now, is it moving you? Is it driving you? Do you have a desire in your life? And again, I'm not talking about money. I'm not talking about material things. What do you want to become? And that is a pursuit that has to be done purposefully, not going to home going home and sitting on the couch watching TV, turning on Netflix, scouring through social media for the next two hours, watching the news. If you were purposeful, what would you do tomorrow that would start your new life to get you where you want to be five years from now? How about five months from now? What do you have to do tomorrow to start really living your life and cease to just exist. That's not a fulfilling life for anyone. And I just want you to accept this challenge. Find your life. Find your purpose. Breathe. 